Hello and welcome to Oracle PL SQL video tutorial. In this video, we'll take a look at constants, variables, and bind variables. A constant is a, is a fixed value. This value, once set at the time of writing the code, it cannot be changed by the program. This value cannot be changed during runtime or cannot be changed dynamically. Constants are declared in and initialized in the declarative part of the program. To declare constants, we provide constant name, constant keyword, data type, assignment operator, and value. Variables can be assigned values in the program by the program dynamically or at runtime. They are like containers and they can hold a value. Variables are declared in the decl declarative part. At the time of declaration, they need not to be assigned a value. A program can change a variable's value anywhere in the program in executable part. Variables can also be initialized optionally. Below are examples of how to declare variables. The first example, in the first example, we are providing variable name and data type. Here we are assigning a value to the variable at the time of de declaring it. This is called initialization of a variable variable name data type assignment operator and value in a plsql code we can assign value to a variable by using select into statement you can assign values to one or multiple variables but you need to be careful about the order order of columns in select list and variables in into clause. So the select statement must return as many values as there are variables in the into clause and their data types and sizes should also match. Also we should be careful about the return rows. The return rows are the are the Resultant row should not exceed 1. If more than one row is returned, then Oracle will return an error. Let's put the example given below into practice. Here we are declaring variable of number data type, emp cell. In the select statement, we are fetching salary of employee ID 100 and in into clause, we are assigning this salary columns value to the variable EMP cell. And again, we are using output built-in package here and we are concatenating a string with EMP cells value and outputting it. The string says employee ID 100 salary is and concatenation operator than the variable to output variable value. Now execute the script and we can see the output here. A bind variable is a placeholder waiting to be given a valid value. SQL statements with bind variable will wait for a user or program response to provide valid values. In an environment like SQL Developer, we declare them by using keyword variable and in the query, we put column before their name to tell the query that it is a bind variable. So it will prompt user for a valid value.
Here we are declaring a bind variable name VEMPID and using it in the SQL query to prompt user to provide a valid employee ID. Here is our bind variable. So when we run this code, it will ask us to provide an employee ID value. And after accepting the value, the code will run and show us the result.